Good morning, this is Malaika. Welcome to Rise and Shine. Start sitting tall on your mat. Roll your shoulders down. Place your hands on your lap and close your eyes. Take a deep inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth. Whenever you're ready, bring your right ear to your right shoulder, your chin to your chest, left ear to left shoulder, chin up. Make another slow circle in this direction, releasing any tension in your neck and shoulders. Reverse the circles, breathing slowly and deeply as we prepare our body and mind for our practice. Nice. Come back to center and open your arms by your side, palm facing forward. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, twist to your right. Place your right hand behind you. Inhale, grow tall. And exhale, push gently your left hand into the outside of your right leg to twist a little deeper. Come back, inhale your arms up and exhale to your left. Inhaling, growing tall. Exhaling, pull your belly button in and twist a little deeper. Nice. Come back to center and come into your tabletop. Wrist right under your shoulders. Finger wide open and knees directly under your hips. Inhale, drop your belly, look up for cow. Exhale, pull your belly button in, round your back for cat. Inhale, gaze up, feel your chest opening. Exhale, press through your arms, bring your chin to your chest for cat. Do a couple more of cat cows on your own, breathing slowly. Sit on your heels, come into a child's pose. Place your forehead on your mat. Keep your shoulder relaxed as you reach your arms forward. Draw your hips down and feel your spine getting longer. Breathe deeply. In your next inhale, slowly rise. Curl your toes under and reach your hips up and back for a dundalk. Relax your neck. Bend one knee then the other, wiggle your hips, and find a steady pose. Right now, the most important is to elongate the spine. So don't worry if your heels are not touching the floor. In your next inhale, bend your knees, arch your back, and walk your feet forward for a forward fold. Relax your head and feel the release in your lower back and in the back of your legs. Pull your belly in and gently come up, bone by bone, rolling your shoulder open. Inhale, raise your arms up. Exhale, bring your hands to heart center. Relax your shoulders, spread your feet on the ground. Pull your belly button in, stand tall. Nice and comfortable posture. This is Rise and Shine, so let's do a couple of sun salutations. Inhale. Reach your arms up, exhale for a fold. Inhale, place your hands on your shins for a flat back. Exhale, hands down, step your right foot back, then your left foot back into a plank. Drop down to your knees, bend your elbows. Inhale, slide your torso forward, open your chest for a low cobra. Exhale, lift your knees, press back into a dundalk. Take two deep breaths here. In your next inhale, look up and step your right foot in, then your left for a forward fold. Inhale, hands on your shins, flat back. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, roll your spine all the way up. Roll your shoulders open, reaching up. Exhale, bring your hands to heart center. Inhale, bring your arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, flat back, hands on your shins. 
Exhale down, step your left foot back, then the right for high plank. Exhale, lower to Chaturanga. Inhale for up dog or cobra. Exhale into your down dog. Inhale and exhale slowly. As you push yourself away from the mat and you reach your hips towards the ceiling. In your next inhale, bend your knees, arch your back, step your left foot in, then the right for forward folds. Inhale for a flat back, exhale for a fold. Inhale, roll your spine all the way up, reaching your arms up over your head. Exhale, bring your hands to heart center. Inhale, raise your arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Step your left foot back. Gently drop your left knee and uncurl your toes for a low lunge. Inhale, your right arm up for a twist. Use your core to lift your torso up into a low twisted crescent lunge. Inhale, extend your arms all the way as if you were throwing rays of light from your fingers. In your next inhale, lower your right arm down and exhale, reach both arms overhead, looking up for your Anjanayasana. Sink into your hips, keeping them square. Take one more deep inhale. Exhale, lower your arms down and shift your hips back into a half split. Here, Imagine that someone is pulling your right hip back to lengthen the back of your right leg. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, fold. Inhale, come back forward to a low lunge. Pivot your left foot to a 45 degree angle. Keep your right knee open above your ankle and rise into a warrior two. Your legs are strong, belly buttons pulled in. Inhale, extend your front leg Shift your torso forward. Exhale, place your right hand on your shin, reaching your left arm straight up for an extended triangle. Breathe. Try to stack your hips by really engaging and rotating the right hip forward. In your next inhale, come back up. Pivot your toes to face the side of your mat. You can adjust your stance by bringing your feet a little closer. Exhale to fold forward into a wide leg forward fold. Place your hands down, hinge from your hips. Feel the release in your lower back. You can place your elbows down to the floor if this is available for you, but make sure that you're not shifting your weight forward. Pivot your toes to the right and walk your hands to the front of your mat. Keep your arms inside your right leg for runner's lunge. And step your left foot forward on the outside of your left hand for Malasana. In this pose, you want to have your feet flat on the floor. So you might need to increase the space between your feet. Your elbows are inside your knees and your hands are at heart center. Lift and extend your chest upward. Gently release. Place your hands down and lift your hips up for forward fold. Inhale, come up, raising your arms up. Exhale, bring your hands to heart center. Inhale, your arms up. Exhale, fold. Step your right foot back and lower your right knee down. Align your right hand with your left foot. Inhale, raise your left arm up. Exhale, engage your core to come up into your twisted crescent lunge. Relax your shoulders and extend your arms out all the way to your fingertips. Inhale and exhale, lower your left arm and untwist. Inhale, both arms up for your crescent move. Keep your core engaged. Feel your spine getting longer. Inhale. Exhale, bring your arms down and shift your hips back. Your back is flat. Your left foot is flexed. And square your hips by lowering your left hip. Try to bring your belly closer to your thigh at each exhale. Feel the stretch in the back of your leg and in your lower back. Inhale, come forward to your lunge. Curl your toes and lift your knee. Take your time to come up into your warrior two. Your core tight 
and your legs are anchored into your mat as you elongate your torso. Inhale, extend your front leg. Reach forward with your left arm, your upper body follows, and tilt down for Trikonasana, triangle pose. Stack your hips and feel the stretch on the outside of your right hip. Inhale, come up. Rotate your left foot in. Interlace your fingers behind you. Inhale, look up. Open your shoulders and chest. Exhale, hinge at your hips for your wide legged forward fold. Let your arms fall and appreciate this shoulder opener. Breathe and relax. Do not force anything. Release your hands down. Pivot your toes to the left and walk your hands to the inside of your left leg for runner's lunge. Step your left foot back for plank, back at your elbows for chaturanga. Inhale into cobra or up dog. Exhale into down dog. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Raise your sit bones up and feel the space creating in your spine. Breathe deeply. From your down dog, walk your feet forward to touch. Generously bend your knees, engage your core and come up into a chair pose. Glue your legs and feet together. Make sure your pelvis is tilted in to keep your back flat and maintain a straight line from the tailbone to the back of your head. With control, lower your hips down until you sit on the middle of your mat. Extend your legs in front of you and remove the flesh from under you. Inhale, extend long through the torso. Exhale, bend forward at the waist. You can keep your knees slightly bent. Keep your neck neutral, your back flat, and relax your arms by your side. The goal here is not to touch the toes, but to stretch your spine and your hamstrings. Inhale, pull your navel in and come up. Exhale, round your back, bring your chin to your chest and lower down to your mat. Keep your right knee in and extend your left leg. Take a deep inhale and exhale, cross your right knee over to the left for a supine twist. Open your arms on your sides as a T. Keep your shoulder blade on the mat. Look at your right hand. Breathe and release. Slowly come back to center and switch leg. Bring your left knee in and extend your right leg. Inhale and exhale, bring your left knee down to the right. Keep your left shoulder down and look at your left hand. Breathe deeply. Come back and take any movement you may need before we end our practice. And whenever you're ready, bring your knees to your nose for a final squeeze. Release and lay down for your Shavasana. Let your feet and legs fall open. Release your arms by your side, palms facing up. Relax your shoulders, keep your neck long, Separate your teeth and completely let go. Take a deep inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth. Start moving your feet and hands. Move your head side to side. Move your arms and legs and roll over to one side using your top hand to sit up in a comfortable position. Take a deep 
inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth good job on your morning practice may you shine all day and I will see you soon namaste hi this is Malaika I hope that you enjoy practice don't forget to like and comment there's also a longer version of this flow if you would like to try if you have not done so, you can subscribe to my channel so you can get notifications when new videos are being uploaded every one to two weeks. Thank you and I will see you soon for more yoga. Namaste!